So I've come to Lambton School to look at a classroom that's been designed by the pupils themselves. It's using a lot of technology. They won a competition to come up with their ideas for what would work in a modern classroom. We're going to have a quick look. Well, basically, this has been a three-year-long research project where they've taken all the best ideas that are already going on all over the world and pulled the things that they think will be most appropriate for our students in our school into here. Um, so part of that's about the technology, so having iPads and Fizbooks, which are touchscreen computers, having screens that you can show work on or that can be interactive where you're sharing work or sharing ideas, um, the walls that you can write on everywhere around the classroom, tables that you can write on everywhere around the classroom, Classroom. It's all about collaborative work and being interactive and sharing with a critical focus. So it's about building those skills that we know employers ask for time and time again. So here are, here are the designers, the design team. Um, it might look a bit casual. Uh, one of them's got a, a baby brother with them. Well, they're actually uh, on holiday now because they've just done their GCSEs, but they've come in specially to, uh, to show us what's going on. So um, what's your name? Adrian. And tell me a bit about what you've done to this classroom. What, what, what's special about this classroom? I think one special thing about this classroom is the furniture, because the way the tables are arranged allows students to choose how they like to learn. Um, so it could be individually or in like large groups. My name's Stefan, and one thing that we've done in the classroom is um, absolutely everything in the classroom is interactive. So we've got um, whiteboards on the wall. Um, we got um, iPads and Fizbooks and different types of um, tech so all the kids can use and use it different ways to learn in. So is an iPad really something for learning or is it just for playing games on? <laughs> I would, you could use it for both but in here it's for learning, definitely for learning. Uh, hi, I'm Iero. Um I think one of the most crucial things in our classroom was the light system where we researched it and we found that different lights instigate different moves and moods and can help um, with your learning. For example, red is a colourway that we put on in the morning because during our research we found that red um, encourages people to wake up and it stimulates the mind and after lunch we put on blue because it's a rela relaxing colour and uh, we, it helps get you back into the working ethic after. Uh, it's not just uh, iPads, we've got... What, what's, what's this called? Oh, these are Fizbooks. Uh, so you could either have like a selection of choices, so you could use the, la um, the iPads or the Fizbook. But um, I, I think the Fizbooks are much better because as you can see you can turn that and it's a touch screen as well. So say if you're doing a mind map or anything and you've got to show, so your group around this table. And you can also draw on the table so you can just turn it around and show everyone. And you also have a chill out area of um, there, so the classroom is split up. So um, we have like areas of people that may have different needs. So that also helps you learn much more better. And also you've got single tables, so say if you learn better individually, um, you could just sit there and do your work instead. So what's the final verdict from the design team? Um, is, is this working? Are, are, are the, the pupils are learning better? Are the teachers finding it good? Um, yeah, definitely, because I think it's like it's a, a transformed classroom and it's different to what the um, students in the school would actually expect. So I think it really helps because it's a, it's a room that they're not really used to and it feels more like you're working at home. So in that sense, I guess. I think it's working great because it's a change of what um, a normal day at school. So if a child comes in here, they're actually looking forward to what's going to happen in the lesson and not thinking, oh, I don't want to go to this lesson, what's going to happen. If you're a slow worker or a fast worker, you can work at your own pace in this classroom. <coughs> and I think that's quite beneficial to students. And what, what, what's the, the best thing do you, do you think about this? Um, the fact that we have um, technology for people to use. Like, uh, for example, some people at home may not be lucky to have a computer or may have a laptop but have a big family to share so they have, don't have time to do their homework. But when they come to school to see, be in an environment, they could learn and more comfortable. They have so much uh, computers and iPads to use. It's just they can focus and learn new skills. Well, thank you very much, guys. Um, very interesting to hear about your um, interactive classroom. Well done. Thanks.